All right, so it, this patient here has a malignant mesothelioma. It's spread in numerous locations in the lungs and particularly this dominant chest wall mass here. So I've got this low density region in the tumor, which is the, the hypoxic region. That's again at the area that's kind of sucking up all the immune cells. Different than other patients where we're using the stereotactic body radiation, this patient will use cryoablation to freeze this area and then we will inject a combination of both immunotherapy and chemotherapies and we're using numerous immunotherapy agents, up to about 10 agents on, on this case. And there'll probably be a series of, of multiple injections as we go along, but this is the starting out. And the one concept is, you know, freezing this area of tumor, we kill off some tumor, we kill off the hypoxic region, which is immune suppressing, and we uh, release, you know, dead pieces of tumor along with these immunotherapy drugs to be able to get an enhanced immune response, creating almost like a vaccine effect, not only here, but this So right now we're just setting up our cryoablation system. We use a liquid nitrogen cryoablation system which freezes faster, which has been shown to actually have an enhanced immune response compared to some of the other systems. We have to test it before we put it in the patient. mixing of uh, chemotherapy and immunotherapy into a oil-based substance that helps keep it within the tumor. You can see in this case where we've got all these white areas or the contrast mixed with the immunotherapy and chemotherapy agents. Now it spreads all throughout the tumor from top to the bottom. So very, very good distribution. And that's one of the things we put this contrast in so we can see that the medication spread all throughout the tumor. And this the interesting technique with this combination of chemotherapy and immunotherapy where the chemotherapy is an ultra low dose directly in the tumor giving us some tumor killing. It kills off some of the regulatory cells which enhances the immune response and then you've got that combination that multi-combination immunotherapy going in with it so this uh, significantly enhances the overall response with uh, a lot of synergy between all these different drugs.